Well, this is how it can look at one of India's most popular beach destinations. But at the same time, this is also what it could look like at a popular beach destination. So, what am I trying to say here? Simply that India is a country of many faces. And to find the face you're looking for, you might need to put in some extra efforts. First, let's go back to the start. India is a melting pot of chaos, beauty and radiant culture, which reflects even at the beach. It's fun and unique. But if you're looking for turquoise water and string bikinis, this might not be for you. Not to say Indian beaches can't be gorgeous. Just take a sip of that dynamite of a cocktail and lean back. And yes, your suspicions are right. Cows will be roaming all over the beaches. Me? 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 These magnificent creatures are sacred animals in India and do pretty much whatever they want. Just enjoy their company. <laughs> Although they might cause you a few slight traffic delays. It's impossible separating religion, culture and everyday life. In India, Hinduism is infused on all levels. Hindu ceremonies are a real treat and will often be allowed to watch. Just ask first. Yes, you'll even find the gods at the dining table. As a Westerner, be ready for your presence to draw attention. People might even stare at you openly. And they will probably ask for photos. Just remain patient and polite. I'm a Richard and uh, uh, I love Swedish people. I've been to Sweden. It's an amazing place and I'm looking forward to hang out with Richard. You'll find out the Indian people are among the friendliest in the world. So, the Indian population suffers from a considerably shortage of women. Also, due to cultural reasons, the vast majority of the locals a tourist interacts with will be men. By the way, two men holding hands is a common expression for friendship. Alcohol is a tricky subject. The regulations can differ from state to state and a few ban it entirely. In Goa, it's all in. Electronical music is the main flavor in the more touristic parts.
clubs, girls often walk in for free to even out the gender ratio. And hey, the dance floor is also a great place to find friends. Do yourself a favor, leave the beach or the busy streets for a second. India sits on some absolutely spectacular nature. And a great chance for wild animal encounters. Always ask first if you're allowed to feed the animals and make sure they are not mistreated. <laughs> Drive! I know, you're scared that Tommy won't be able to handle real Indian street food, but not experiencing these flavors is an even worse fate. It will be spicy though. But this special omelette to die for. Yep, we've all seen the scenic train pictures on Instagram. But if you don't know what you're doing, traveling by train can be an uncomfortable life lesson. And they are often horrifically slow. Bus will probably be faster. It barely even stops to pick you up. On a night bus, you might even get a few hours of sleep as the landscape is shifting outside. Just don't fall out of your bed. To sum it up, you need to visit India. Just like you need to try seafood, licorice and naked parachuting to see if it's up your alley. You'll either be hooked for life or glad you gave it a shot. Thank you for watching. Stay tuned for another video within two weeks.